I have heard people say, oh my goodness, Sonko helps the poor. Sonko does not help the poor. Sonko takes advantage of the poor. Sonko uses the poor to delude, to mislead, to lie and deceive to the citizens of Kenya that he cares. At the end of the day, all Sonko cares about is Sonko. He wants to get power so that he can continue to steal, so that he can continue to accumulate ill-gotten wealth, so that he can use the handouts that he has uh, handouts from the money that he has stolen from the people. Ask yourself the question. This man did not go beyond Form 2. This man went to Shimolatewa prison for committing heinous crimes against innocent Kenyans. So where has he gotten all the money that he's splashing around? Where did he get the money? He's not an inventor. He has not invented anything. He's not an industrialist. He does not own a factory that produces real wealth. He's not a sports star so that you could say he's being paid because he's an Olympic champion in any kind of sports. He's not a singer or an artist. He has not produced anything. He's not written a book that has sold and made him billions. He's not a farmer. He does not own uh, precious stones. He does not have any known business. Running two matatus to ten matatus does not make anybody a billionaire. And you cannot take from matatu business uh, the few millions that you've made so that you can distribute it. So where has he gotten his wealth? This is a very important question. Ask movie. Do you have a copy of your continuous assessment tests? He never did them. Do you have a copy of your major research papers that you did? He never, he doesn't have. Do you have a copy of your admission? He does not have. If you look at his admission number correctly from the university he purportedly attended, you will find that that admission number belongs to another student. That is Mbuvi. That is after he ran away from St. Paul's University after he realized that they would not give him a fake degree. I appeal to you to be laser focused, to be disciplined, not to allow these petty purveyors of retrogression to sideswipe you. Let us move together. Let us mobilize everyone we can reach. We must liberate Nairobi. Meguna Bomaye.